Welcome to the campus of Murray State University and to the Hudson School of Agriculture. I'm Tony Brannon, Dean of the Hudson School of Agriculture, and today we're hosting our sixth annual Hemp Field Day. We've got a great uh, display of research and education and policy stops out on the tours, and we just thank everybody so much for coming and taking advantage of the opportunity to be on our campus here today. It's great to be involved in this industry, and it's great to be a leader in this industry. Great turnout, great turnout. Overwhelming crowds. I remember a few years ago when there was maybe 50, 60 people standing around at the Hemp Field Day here at Murray State, and to have 300 people show up today, media, uh, politicians, a lot, of, a lot of different folks here, a lot of different interests from farmers to business folks to bankers to insurance companies. Uh, you're starting to see the hemp industry really start to take flight. wonderful thing about hemp is it's really a triple crop. You've got grain and then you've got fiber and then you've actually got the floral material and the CBD. So we want to grow all of those uh, uh, together and not just concentrate on one because of the ebbs and flows of the market. Certainly right now the CBD is driving the market. I say a rising tide rises all ships. Let's work with the whole plant and eventually I think we'll get it figured out to where we're using all three uses with one pass. That'll be the ultimate goal. It's great to see all the interest and excitement around this crop and to see real farmers attending these field days and going station to station, asking questions, being very inquisitive about this crop so that they can learn and hopefully succeed and really make this a commodity crop where we're using the whole plant and bettering the planet for it. So Dr. Brandon, we've been here now for six years researching hemp at Murray State, the Hudson Absolutely. School of Agriculture. Talk to us about the Center for Agricultural Hemp and, and what you guys are doing with that. Well, uh, with CV Sciences uh, lead, we're starting this crop at the ground and, and, and raising it up. There's not a lot of research funding. There's not a lot of educational funding available. So we depended upon uh, companies and, and industry to help us. And we had several foundational partners that step up to create the Center for Agricultural Hemp at Murray State, which has allowed us to do all this uh, uh, demonstration and research out there. The kind of information they're learning here at Murray State about how to grow this crop and how to do it efficiently and effectively, CV Sciences can take their domestic supply chain and really build it out here and start sourcing material from states like Kentucky, Indiana, Illinois, et cetera, and, and really try to grow that domestic supply chain so that we can start using domestically sourced hemp in all of our plus CBD products. It's been another great day for agriculture at Murray State. We're studying hemp from seed to shelf, just like CV Sciences. We invite you to come join us here as we grow this industry. It's hemp, it's okay. <laughs>